Almost five years after retired FBI agent Robert Levinson vanished in Iran, the public is getting its first look at a shocking proof-of-life video sent to his family late last year. The Levinson family and the U.S. government have decided to release this footage showing the now 63-year-old man haggard but unharmed. I have been held here for three and a half years. I am not in very good health. Levinson had been retired from the FBI for years and was working as a private investigator when he traveled to Iran in March 2007. His family has said that during that visit, he went to the Iranian resort island of Kish to investigate claims of cigarette smuggling. He checked out of his hotel on March 9th, and that was the last official record of him. That is, until that video and a series of photographs appeared in his wife's email inbox. I have been treated well. But I need the help of the United States government to answer the requests of the group that has held me for three and a half years. And please help me get home. Earlier this year, Secretary of State Hillary Clinton announced publicly that Levinson was alive, and she asked Iranian officials for help finding him. That request led to a series of discreet government talks but it seems those diplomatic efforts have stalled. Now the Levinson family is looking to personally reconnect with whoever is holding the father of seven. We are not part of any government, and we are not experts on the region. No one can help us but you. I am sending this message because we need to know what you want our family to do so that my father can come home safely. Some government officials have said they believe Levinson was arrested by Iranian intelligence officials and that he was being used as a bargaining chip. But there's no evidence pointing to that theory, and the Iranians have repeatedly denied that they are behind Levinson's disappearance. He could be in Afghanistan, he could be in Pakistan, he could be in Iran. Um, the photos uh, that came subsequent to the, to the video, um, the, they were actually able to track, uh, the government was actually able to track um, you know, electronically back to an internet address in Afghanistan, whereas the video, they were able to track it back to Pakistan. So, I mean, it's, it's really a very, uh, it's really a difficult pu puzzle to put together. Even though U.S. relations with Iran have been strained in recent months, there is still reason to hope that diplomatic efforts could work in this case. It was behind-the-scenes talks that led to the release of two American hikers from an Iranian prison in September. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.